Good evening students, families, friends, and faculty of Oregon High School. Welcome to my house tonight to honor our Oregon High School class of 2020 with our virtual honors night. We really appreciate all of the contributions that have been made by this incredible group of young men and women who will be honored tonight. I couldn't be more proud of them over the course of their four years here. They have made a difference. They have set the bar high for themselves and for every single class that will follow. They are full of compassion, optimism, hope, and talent. And I know moving forward that they are going to make a difference. We're gonna need you to. Um, and so class of 2020, the leadership you've displayed here has been exemplary. And we know that you'll take it forward and do wonderful things um, as the rest of your future unfolds. We also want you to know that we are here with you and for you during this time. Tonight is a night for celebrating you, and we are going to get to that here in a moment. Before we do, I want to recognize a few special people that have made tonight possible. Counselor Kelly Jurasevich and Admin Assistant Andrea Canal have done incredible work to organize our scholarship committee, to prepare all of our materials, and to get this video produced. Uh, it is not a typical undertaking and it is heavy lifting in a normal year and tonight more so than ever. So thank you so much. And we also would be remiss if we did not thank our wonderful community partners who will be presenting um, and awarding our 2020 seniors with amazing scholarships. They're recognizing your ability, your accomplishments and your potential. And without their contributions, these nights could not be possible. Each year we award more than $60,000 of scholarship money and we are grateful for those contributions of the community partners. We could not do it without you. We also want to take time to say thank you to Ivan Ripley. Ivan Ripley is one of our tech support pairs at Oregon High School. He is in charge tonight of putting this whole slideshow together. Thank you so much, Ivan, for stepping up again and doing a phenomenal job for our students and families in the Oregon School District. Job well done. So thank you all so much. Let's get this thing started. I'm so proud to be your principal. I'm proud to be here with you. And you guys are amazing. So enjoy tonight. You keep classy, OHS. Let's get this going. As Oregon High School principal, it is my honor to present awards to some of the top achieving students in the class of 2020. The State of Wisconsin Higher Education AIDS Board administers the Academic Excellence Scholarship Program. This scholarship is awarded to students who have the highest grade point average in their graduating class at the end of first semester of their senior year and who plan on attending a Wisconsin college or university. Based on enrollment, Oregon High School is awarded three scholarships. Each scholarship is worth $2,250 per year for four years. The 2020 Wisconsin Academic Excellence Awards will go to Isabella Pierce. Isabella will attend UW-Madison to study business and math. L. Romanen. L. will attend Edgewood College in the fall and plans on majoring in chemistry with a minor in theater performance. And our third Wisconsin Academic Excellence Award goes to Alex Tanner. Alex will attend UW-Madison and will major in mechanical engineering. The State of Wisconsin Higher Educational AIDS Board also administers the Technical Excellence Scholarship Program. This scholarship is awarded to students who have earned the most credits in technical education by the end of first semester of their senior year and plan to attend a Wisconsin Technical College. Based on enrollment, Oregon High School is allotted three scholarships. Each scholarship is worth $2,250 per year for two years. The class of 2020 Wisconsin Technical Excellence Awards this year will go to Brody Barlow, Evan Wald and Gianna Schultz. Congratulations to all three of you and best luck in the future. Our next presenter is Dr. Brian Bustler, superintendent of the Oregon School District. He has been your superintendent for your entire run in the Oregon schools. And we wanna thank him. This is his retirement year. Dr. Bustler will be moving on as well. And his leadership has been outstanding over the course of 15 years. He has helped build this school district and establish a values-based leadership philosophy that will continue on into the future. We want to thank him sincerely for his contributions, his friendship, his leadership, his mentorship, and just his commitment. Uh, we would not be where we are without Dr. Bustler, 
And he has a quirk that I always appreciate when he wants to give somebody a standing ovation. Rather than the audience stand, he asks them to stand and we give him an ovation. So Dr. Bussell, wherever you are, please stand up. And we in the Oregon School District applaud you for your service, your leadership, and your commitment. Thank you. Take it away, Dr. Bussler. Good evening, everyone. My name is Dr. Brian Bussler. I'm the superintendent of schools in the Oregon School District. The Bussler Family Scholarship has been provided by my wife and I over the last several years. My wife is also a career educator. The Oregon High School Scholarship Committee has selected two extraordinary young people for this year's scholarship, Henry Butzloff and Brindley Hall. Congratulations to both of you and we wish you the best in the years ahead. Good evening. My name is Brad Ashmore. I am one of the associate principals at Oregon High School. Tonight, it's my honor to be presenting the Oregon Masonic Scholarship. The $1,500 Oregon Masonic Scholarship is awarded each year to a student who has achieved top academic standing in the school. The recipient must also have demonstrated leadership and service to Oregon High School. This year's award recipient is Sam Canny. Congratulations, Sam. The honor is well-deserved. Good evening. My name is Ms. Bayarski and I teach family consumer sciences here at Oregon High School. Hello, my name is Peter Critch and I'm a biology and biotechnology teacher at Oregon High School. It is my honor to be awarding the J. Susan Ames Memorial Scholarship. This scholarship goes to a student who plans to attend the University of Wisconsin-Madison and study in the biological sciences area. This scholarship is valued at $800. This year's recipients are Rachel Jennings and Inra Valdes. Best wishes on your future in science. The Ruth T. Ames and E. A. Kozlowski Scholarship is open to any graduating senior. The only requirement is that they plan to attend the University of Wisconsin-Madison in a four-year degree program. The value of this scholarship is $200, and this year's recipient is Claire Wagner. Hello, I am Mike Doucette, an OHS English teacher, and I am pleased to present the Junie Hansen Memorial Scholarship, which provides for a $1,000 award to a student who has a clearly defined career path. It is a great honor to present this year's scholarship recipient to Kenneth Critch. Congratulations, Kenneth. It is well-deserved. This year's female recipient is Erin Brackob. Congratulations, Erin. Hello, my name is Kelly McGraw and I'm a social studies teacher and basketball coach at Oregon High School. Tonight I will be awarding one of the Oregon Administrators Scholarships. This scholarship is awarded to a top academic student who plans to pursue a four-year degree and has demonstrated outstanding community and school citizenship. This year's $800 scholarship is awarded to Malia Moyer. Congratulations Malia, we're so proud of you. Hi there, my name is Michelle Porter and I'm representing the OASIS program at Oregon High School. I have the distinguished honor of presenting the recipient for the Oregon Administrative Scholarship, one of the recipients. Her name is Amber McLeod. She is so deserving of this award. Uh, she has demonstrated singular perseverance and inspiring character. Uh, Amber will be continuing her education at Madison College, where she will pursue a degree in the human resources field. So congratulations, Amber. We love you. Good work. Hi, I'm Eric Anderson, president of the Oregon Soccer Club. Our club was formed in 1978, and for the past 42 years, we have provided children of all ages in our community the opportunity not only to improve their soccer skills, but also to learn important life skills. Since 2014, it has been our pleasure to award scholarships to outstanding OHS seniors. It is my great honor to announce the recipient of this year's $500 Boys Scholarship Award to Colin Bierke. Congratulations, Colin, and all the best to you in college and in the rest of your soccer career. For the past six years, it has been our honor to present scholarships to excellent OHS seniors. These student athletes not only participated in OHS soccer programs, but also have been a part of the Oregon Soccer Club. Our girls recipient this year more than meets that standard. 
as she's been a part of our club since the very beginning of her playing days. It is my great pleasure to announce the recipient of our $500 Girls Scholarship, Ellen Legler. Congratulations, Ellen, and all the best to you in college. The Oregon branch of the State Bank of Cross Plains is presenting a $500 scholarship to an Oregon high school senior who plans to attend either a two or four year college and is interested in pursuing a career in a business related field. The recipient of this year's State Bank of Cross Plains Oregon scholarship is Olivia Marsden. Congratulations, Olivia, and best wishes on your start to your career in business. The Stoughton Hospital Medical Staff Scholarship awards two $750 scholarships annually to students pursuing advanced education in either medicine or nursing. Students should display character and leadership, have at least a 3.0 cumulative GPA, and have participated in a variety of school and extracurricular activities. This year's award winners are Megan Detra and Lauren Gregg. Congratulations to both of you and best wishes on your studies. The Linka Kempf Memorial Scholarship is awarded to two students each year who will be attending either a two or four year college or university. This $500 scholarship will be awarded to Colin Lindloff and Hallie Washbeck. Congratulations to both of you. I also have the honor tonight to present the Manley Draper Family Scholarship. The Manley Draper Family Scholarship was established in 1976 to honor a top academic student. This year's recipient of the $750 Draper Family Scholarship will be Ethan Vandermoos. Congratulations, Ethan. Well deserved. Hello, I'm Jennifer Yancey. I'm presenting the Oregon School District Staff Scholarship. This fund was created through the gifting of service award credit from staff members across the school district for the purpose of recognizing students who have worked hard throughout their high school career. I'd like to congratulate Addison Zineman for receiving the OSD Staff Scholarship. Congratulations, Addison. One of this year's OSD Staff Scholarships is awarded to Ashley Hansen. Congratulations, Ashley. My name is Missy Hahn, and I'm one of the school counselors here at OHS, and I am so very honored to be a part of the presentation of awards. The first award I would like to be presenting tonight is one of the OSD Staff Scholarships in the amount of $500. For all of your hard work throughout your high school career, we would like to recognize Kyle Paulson. Congratulations, Kyle. Hello, I'm Ms. Hayhurst, and I'm here to award one of four $500 OSD staff scholarship fund awards. Tonight, one of these $500 scholarships goes to Megan Weezy. Congratulations, Megan. The Oregon Community Scholarship Fund was established in 2013 through donations from local businesses, organizations, and individuals for scholarships to give to dedicated OHS students. This year, 10 recipients will be awarded a $300 scholarship from this fund. One of those recipients is Carson Noble. Congratulations, Carson. Good evening. My name is Andrea Anderson, and I'm a senior advisor at Oregon High School. I'm pleased on behalf of the Oregon Community Scholarship Fund to present a $300 scholarship to a very deserving Panther and member of my advisory, Anna Donovan. The next recipient of an award in the amount of $300 from the Oregon Community Scholarship is presented to Carly Pultz. Congratulations, Carly. Hi, my name is Nicole Buell, and I am presenting the Oregon Community Scholarship. This $300 scholarship is being awarded to Zoe Frank. Congratulations. I'm pleased on behalf of the Oregon Community Scholarship Fund to present a $300 scholarship to a very deserving Panther and member of my advisory, Thomas Snow. The next recipient of an award in the amount of $300 from the Oregon Community Scholarship is presented to Benjamin Schaefer. Congratulations, Ben. Hello, my name is Kim Griffin, Associate Principal at Oregon High School. Tonight, I am honored to be awarding the Oregon Community Fund Scholarship of $1,000. It is with great privilege that I award the scholarship to Nicole Colcombs. Congratulations, Nicole. We are so proud of you and wish you the best beyond OHS. The next recipient of an award in the amount of $300 from the Oregon Community Scholarship is presented to 
Reynaldo Ramos. Congratulations, Ray. Hi, my name is Nicole Buell, and I'll be presenting the Oregon Community Scholarship. This $300 scholarship is being awarded to Jack Lang. Congratulations. Hello, my name is Mike Doucette, and I am pleased to present a scholarship through the Oregon Community Scholarship Fund. It is my sincerest pleasure to award one of these scholarships to Veronica Kamakova. Congratulations, Veronica. It is well-deserved. Hello, my name is Elisa Reed. I am representing the Hagstrom Scholarship. The $250 Hagstrom Scholarship is given to a student who attends OASIS and is selected by the OASIS staff. This year's award goes to Eliza Gartley. Congratulations. The $500 Scoville Improvement Award was started by Marilyn Scoville, a former cook at OHS, and is awarded to a student who has made significant progress throughout their high school career, despite academic challenges. This year's award winner is Myra Hernandez. Congratulations. Hello, my name is Mike Victorson, and I'm here tonight to represent the Opportunity 34 Foundation. This year, the Opportunity 34 Foundation will be giving a scholarship in the amount of $3,400 to this year's winner, Lauren Denou. Congratulations, Lauren. My name is Nathan Johnson. I'm here as a member of the Board of Directors of the Oregon Education Association to present the OEA scholarship in the amount of $500. This year's recipient I've known throughout their high school career and I've seen grow as a leader and teacher of their peers and I have no doubt they will make a tremendous educator. Congratulations, Abby Rao, on receiving the OEA scholarship. Hello, my name is Mike Cousette and I am pleased to present the Wisco Industry Scholarship which provides a $500 award to a student who is accepted and enrolled in an approved vocational and technical program. It is my sincerest pleasure to award this year's recipient of the Wisco Industry Scholarship to Annika Hagland. Congratulations, Annika. It is well-deserved. Good evening. I'm Caroline Kissling. It is my pleasure to represent our family in presenting a student with a scholarship in memory of my grandfather, Erwin Kissling. My grandfather lived his professional life as a teacher, coach, and athletic director for the students in Oregon. He had a clear understanding of the profound impact athletics can have on a young person's life. He understood that being a member of an athletic team was not just about developing athletic abilities, but about developing character, perseverance, teamwork, and humility. The recipient this year has, no doubt, developed all of these qualities and more. This year's Erwin Kissling Memorial Scholarship recipient is Brady Garnier. Brady has successfully balanced academics and athletics throughout his high school career, participating in both football and baseball while taking rigorous classes and maintaining a very respectful GPA. Beyond that, Brady is a truly decent human being. We are thrilled to have an excuse to return to our beloved UW Lacrosse to watch Brady play football next year. Congratulations, Brady. Hello, my name is Kyle O'Shaw, and tonight I am presenting the James Reisdorfer Memorial Scholarship. This scholarship is awarded to a senior student who plans to major in engineering. This year's $500 scholarship is awarded to Mr. Jack Fitzgerald. Congratulations, Jack. Hi, my name is Nicole Buell, and I'm here on behalf of myself and my family to present the Jeremy M. Buell Memorial Scholarship. This scholarship is given in memory of my late husband to a senior that exemplifies the characteristics of good character and perseverance. This year, we are happy to say that we have selected Myla Gustafson to receive this $500 scholarship. My name is Julie Wood. When my brother, Jeff Brindley, who was a 1980 graduate of OHS, passed away of cancer, my mom created a scholarship in his honor for someone who was involved in the arts since that was a passion of Jeff's. This year's recipient has been active in theater, including OHS musicals and Oregon Straw Hat player productions. She also even had time to participate in several mission trips during her high school career. I am proud to announce that this year's Jeff Brindley Memorial Scholarship goes to Grace Nichols. Hello, my name is Kyle Oshaw, and I'm presenting the Friends of Allison Norland Scholarship. This scholarship is offered in memory of former student Allison Norland, who passed away in 2014. The recipient of this award will exemplify the same qualities that Allison was so well known for. Compassion, a sense of humor, humility, and a commitment to both school and her community. This is a peer-nominated scholarship, and I am pleased to present this year's $1,000 award to Ms. Hannah Rohrer. Congratulations, Hannah. Good evening. 
My name is Laura Burns, and I'm an orchestra teacher at Oregon High School. Friends of the Orchestra, also known as FOTO, is proud to present three scholarships to seniors who proactively contributed to orchestra, as well as numerous other activities like pit orchestra, seasonal players, solo and ensemble, and music clinics and camps. These three candidates stood out with their examples of personal growth, leadership, freedom of musical expression, and demonstrated a deep understanding and appreciation of music. Congratulations to this year's recipient, Isabella Lindert. Good evening, everyone. My name is Michelle Kabish, and I am an orchestra teacher here at Oregon High School. Friends of the Orchestra Parent Group, also known as FOTO, is proud to present three scholarships to seniors who proactively contributed to the OHS orchestra classes, as well as numerous extracurricular activities. Congratulations goes to Miranda Moore. Congratulations goes to Ms. Corinne Boyd. I am presenting the Tom and Margaret Brown Music Scholarship. The Brown family established a scholarship fund for deserving OHS graduates who have made extraordinary contributions to the music classrooms in the Oregon School District. This year, the Tom and Margaret Brown Music Scholarship in the amount of $1,000 is awarded to Caden Klein. Congratulations, Caden. In 2015, the Friends of the Orchestra, also known as FOTO, along with students, alumni, and parents, established a scholarship in honor of Layla Sonier, who taught orchestra in the Oregon School District for 28 years. This scholarship is awarded to a senior in orchestra who exhibits leadership, has broad interests, and a passion for learning, along with a welcoming and an encouraging attitude towards other orchestra students. I am proud to present this year's Sonier Scholarship to Brianna Salazar. Hello, I'm Ellen Bauer, president of the Oregon Choral Boosters. The OCB Service Award recognizes the dedication and service of students to the vocal music department at Oregon High School. During their four years in the vocal music program, this recipient has made countless contributions such as leadership and musicianship to the choirs and the musical productions at OHS. Their passion for singing has given them countless musical experiences throughout high school, which they will take with them as they continue to participate in music after high school. We are pleased to give the 2020 Oregon Choral Booster Service Award to Caden Klein. We are pleased to give the 2020 Oregon Choral Booster Service Award to Kyle Capusta. We are pleased to give the 2020 Oregon Choral Booster Service Award to Madison Cameron. We are pleased to give the 2020 Oregon Choral Booster Service Award to Miranda Moore. We are pleased to give the 2020 Oregon Choral Booster Service Award to Myla Gustafson. Good evening. My name is Jillian Beatty, and I'm the Agriculture Education Instructor at Oregon High School. Tonight, I'm proudly representing the Oregon FFA alumni and I'm giving four students $500 scholarships to further their education. Tonight, I'd like to congratulate Nicholas T. Brown, Madeline McGinnis, Isabel Finstead, and Morgana Pope. We are so proud of your accomplishments over the past four years, and we wish you the best of luck as you continue your education. Congrats. Hello, I'm Rachel Brickner, the director of the Oregon Area Senior Center. I'm presenting a $500 award from the Oregon Area Council on Aging. This is an opportunity for a group of local senior citizens to provide support to a member of the senior class who has shown dedication to older adults. I'm pleased to announce that this year's winner is Kelsey Belisle. Congratulations, Kelsey. Best wishes to you and to all of the members of the OHS class of 2020. Hi, I'm George Woodbridge of the Oregon Book of the Lions Club. The you know, Lions is a worldwide organization with over 1.4 million people that belong to it. And uh, the main goal of Lionism is service. And all these people throughout the world, again, do what they can do to make life better for other people. Uh, the Oregon Brooklyn Lions Club yearly gives out scholarships. And again, I'm going to be doing that tonight. And I have three scholarships to give out to three very deserving young people. Okay? Uh, the class of 2020, of course, has been through a lot. 
Again, I want to congratulate the entire class for hanging in there and, and graduating soon. It's been a tough year. You gave up a lot of things, etc., in your life that are important to a high school student. So again, I know you're going to come out of this very well. Again, Lionism is all about giving back. And our criteria for our scholarships is not basically just the GPA, etc. It's also what are you giving back to the community. I found uh, a number of students that meet that qualification and I gave these numbers to the uh, committee at the guidance office and they came up with the three people. So first of all, let's start off with uh, Isabella Lindert. Isabella will be attending the University of Minnesota Duluth, the Bulldogs. She plans to major in biology with an emphasis on genetics. Again, that's Isabella Lindert. Congratulations, Isabella. Our second recipient tonight is Chloe Schwartz. Chloe will be attending the University of Wisconsin, Eau Claire, and her plan is to become a nurse. Of course, we know nurses have been in the news so much lately and the healthcare field is definitely needing quality people like Chloe. So again, uh, congratulations to you, Chloe. I know you'll do well at Eau Claire. And our third recipient is Kenneth uh, Krish. Kenneth will be attending Platteville, majoring in uh, technology and engineering down there. And uh, again, uh, he's also very involved in, in musical theater. He wants to get a minor in that. So. Uh, Again, all three youngsters, young gentlemen and ladies in this case, uh, adults, on behalf of the Lions Club of Oregon, Brooklyn, I want to congratulate you on a great four years at Oregon High School and wish you the best in your future. Thank you. Hi, my name is Kyle Osha, and I am presenting the Oregon Rotary Chuck Sell Memorial Scholarship. The Oregon Rotary Scholarships are awarded to students that have performed community service or extracurricular work that showcase leadership, responsibility, and accomplishments and exemplify service above self. Additionally, students must be planning to attend a one, two, or four-year college to further their education. The Oregon Rotary Chuck Sell Memorial Scholarship was open to Rotary Students of the Month, Rotary Exchange outbound students, and Interact members. I am pleased to award this year's $1,750 scholarship to Miss Emma Halverson. Congratulations, Emma. Hello, I'm Gregory Granberg, President-Elect of the Rotary Club of Oregon, Wisconsin. Our foundation is proud to offer a scholarship in the amount of $1,000 to Alex Tanner. Our foundation is proud this year to honor the graduating class of 2020 with over $6,500 in scholarships, including a $1,000 educational scholarship to Jamie Flogo. Our Rotary Club has a foundation that our members donate to on a regular basis in order to support our graduating seniors. This year, one of our $1,000 educational scholarships is going to Jenna Sharkis. Rotary has been involved in the Oregon community for over 75 years, focusing in on education and the environment. This year, we are proud to award one of our scholarships to Nicholas T. Brown. Hello, my name is Tracy Rosemeyer. I am representing the Oregon Rotary Club. Tonight, I will be awarding the Rotary Chuck Sell Memorial Scholarship to Caitlin Lampman. Congratulations, Caitlin, we're very proud of you. I am representing the Oregon Rotary Club. Tonight, I will be awarding the Rotary Interact Scholarship to Claire Wagner. Congratulations, Claire, we're very proud of you. Hi, my name is Anna Petrie, and I am the team manager with the Pure Integrity Homes team. Tonight, I have the honor of awarding the Pure Integrity Homes team scholarship of $1,000. The recipient we are proud to announce is Nora McGinty. Nora, we are so excited for you, and we cannot wait to hear about the wonderful things that you will do in the semesters and years to come. Congratulations to all of you, and congratulations to you, Nora, from all of us at PIH. The Ina Store Oregon Brooklyn Optimist Scholarship is awarded to one of the seven students that were selected as the Optimist of the Month for the 2020 school year. The Oregon Brooklyn Optimist Club is pleased to present their $1,000 award to Kai Narf. Congratulations, Kai. Hello, I'm Jennifer Yancey. I'm presenting the Oregon Town and Country Award. This award is for seniors who have been active in the field of fine arts, including music, drama, literature, and visual arts at OHS or in our community. The Oregon Town and Country Award in the amount of $500 is given to Samantha Mickelson. Congratulations. 
The Oregon Town and Country Award in the amount of $500 is given to Claire Michaels. Congratulations! The Oregon Town and Country Award in the amount of $500 is given to Corinne Boyd. Congratulations! Hello, my name is Chris Prawl. I'm representing the Oregon School District tonight. I'll be awarding the VFW Post 10272 scholarship. This scholarship goes to Nicholas T. Brown. Congratulations, Nicholas. We are so proud of you. Good evening. I'm Janelle Tom Schneider, counselor at Oregon High School. I'm thrilled to be able to present the Oregon Brooklyn VFW Post 10272 scholarship in the amount of $500. This student completed an essay on what their family member's service meant to them and how it affected their life. One of the two scholarship winners is Claire Wagner. Way to go, Claire. Good evening, my name is Rhonda Waldevogel and I am the commander for the Brooklyn, Oregon American Legion Post 160. And tonight, I will be presenting our scholarship in the amount of $500 to Tori Phillips. Congratulations, Tori and the class of 2020. Hello and thanks for joining our virtual honors night tonight. I'm Michael Derrick, OHS art teacher, and I'm honored to be here tonight to present two art scholarships to members of the graduating class. The first scholarship is the OHS Panther Visual Arts Scholarship, and this scholarship is being awarded to James Klon, an incredible, wonderful graphic illustrator who's going to do great things. The second one is the Patricia Keene Art Scholarship given in honor of the former Prairie View art teacher. And this award is going to Eden Meidel. Um, again, both are wonderful artists and look forward to the wonderful things that they're gonna do in the future. So good luck and best wishes to them and all of the graduating and seniors. Thank you. Hi, my name is Kyle Osho and I am presenting the Oregon Athletic Booster Club Scholarship. This scholarship awards $1,000 to two males and two females each year. The students must attend a university, college, or technical school, have a cumulative GPA of at least 2.75, have not incurred a single athletic code violation, earned a varsity letter in at least two different sports. One of those must have been earned during their senior year. Student athletes' families are also part of our Oregon Booster Club. I am happy to present the two male scholarship winners. Blake Anderson and Corey Moore. Congratulations, you guys. Hello, my name is Tracy Rosemeyer. I am representing the Oregon Booster Club. Tonight, I will be awarding the Booster Club Scholarship of $1,000 to Sarah Christensen. Congratulations, Sarah. We are very proud of you. Tonight, I will be awarding one of the Oregon Athletic Booster Club Awards. This year's $1,000 scholarship is awarded to Caitlin Shrimp. Congrats, Caitlin. We are so proud of you. Good evening, everyone. This is Dave Jameson with Oregon Youth Baseball. Once again this year, we are proud to be part of Honors Night. This year, our $500 scholarship goes to Eli Landis. Congratulations, Eli, and good luck at Mankato. Hi, my name is Michael Youngren, president of the Oregon Youth Basketball Board. Since 2013, Oregon Youth Basketball has provided two $500 scholarships to select student applicants. We do this to recognize the strong partnership with the Oregon School District and the importance of supporting opportunities and continuing education for our community youth. It is my privilege to announce the recipients for this year's Oregon Youth Basketball Association Scholarship. They are Caitlin Shrimp and Corey Moore. Congratulations to the two of you. You are both great representatives of Oregon Youth Basketball as well as Oregon schools. Best of luck in the future, congratulations. Hello, my name is John Jakey and I am representing Oregon Youth Football. Tonight, I will be awarding the Oregon Youth Football Scholarship of $500. This scholarship is awarded to Corey Moore. Congratulations, Corey. We are so proud of you and best of luck in the future. Hello, my name is Amy Crow and I'm the president of Oregon Youth Softball. Tonight, on behalf of our board, I'll be awarding our $500 Oregon Youth Softball Scholarship. And the scholarship goes to Aaron Newton. Congratulations, Aaron, and thank you for all that you've done for our youth players in Oregon. 
Hello, I'm Jennifer Yancey. I will be presenting the Sing Out Louise Memorial Scholarship. This scholarship is offered in memory of Louise Uphoff, wife of active community member and past school board member Charles Uphoff. The recipient of this award must have demonstrated interest in theater, arts, or politics, and plan to attend a one, two, or four year college to further their education. The Sing Out Louise Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Carly Monroe. Congratulations, Carly. The Sing Out Louise Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Miranda Moore. Congratulations, Miranda. Hello, I'm Amy Crow, the Financial Education Specialist from Summit Credit Union. Tonight, the Summit Credit Union Scholarship of $500 goes to Aaron McCammock. Congratulations, Aaron, and to all the Oregon High School seniors. Hi, my name is Kim Markham, and I'm honored to be with you tonight on behalf of Colony Brands. Colony Brands awards a variety of scholarships each year, including to students who may work as part of our team or for children of our employees. I am excited to announce tonight that Hallie Washbeck, whose dad, Vince Washbeck, is a valued member of our team, will be receiving a scholarship in the amount of $3,500. Congratulations, Hallie, and congratulations to the rest of the class of 2020 at Oregon High School. We wish you the best of luck for a bright future. Hi, my name is Kyle Losha, and I am presenting the UW Health Scholarship. This scholarship requires the recipient pursue a career in the healthcare industry and demonstrate leadership and community involvement. One of the two winners of this year's $500 scholarship is awarded to Ms. Calla Pagels. Congratulations, Calla. Tonight, I will be awarding one of the UW Health Scholarships. This year's $500 scholarship is awarded to Isabella Peterson. Congratulations, Isabella. We are so proud of you. Tonight, I am honored to be awarding the Bavery Memorial Scholarship. To receive the Russ Bavery Memorial Scholarship, students must be accepted into a two to four year degree program and have at least a high school GPA of 2.5 or higher. Additionally, the student must have been active in at least one area of extracurricular activity for three or more years with a preference given to sports. The recipient should exemplify qualities of honesty, responsibility, generosity, selflessness, leadership, dedication, and a humble attitude such as an unsung hero or a behind the scenes type person. It is with great pleasure to award this year's scholarship to Sadie Gabriel. Congratulations, Sadie. We are so proud of you and wish you success beyond OHS. I have the honor to present the Russ Bavery Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500. This recipient exemplifies leadership and a humble unsung hero attitude. One of this year's award winners is Brooklyn Kane. Congratulations, Brooklyn. Hi, my name is Kyle Oshaw, and I am presenting the Jane Haley Memorial Scholarship. This scholarship is offered through retired OHS counselor Joan Carls in loving memory of her Aunt Jane, who she describes as a great educator, a world traveler, and a generous philanthropist who was always giving to others. The recipient of this award must be pursuing a degree in elementary education. This year's $500 scholarship is awarded to Abigail Schroeder. Congrats, Abby. I'm honored to present the Apple Memorial Scholarship in honor of Oregon High School's first principal in 1966, Henry Apple. I want to present this award in the amount of $300 to Rachel Jennings. Hats off to you, Rachel. Hello, my name is Chris Prawl. I'm representing the Oregon School District tonight. I will be awarding the Apple Scholarship. This scholarship goes to Jenna Sharkis. Congratulations, Jenna. We are so proud of you. In addition to the scholarship awards presented tonight, here are a few OHS students who have earned awards from colleges, universities, or community organizations. We offer our congratulations to them all. Nora McGinty is the recipient of $2,500 from the National Merit University of Texas at Dallas Scholarship. Congratulations, Nora. Jamie Flogel is the recipient of $1,500 from the Biomedical Engineering Scholarship from the University of Wisconsin-Madison. Congratulations, Jamie. Next, Brianna Salzar was awarded $2,500 from the American Family Insurance Dreams Foundation Scholarship. We're proud of you, Brianna. Alex Tanner was awarded the Dorothy Marshall Farley Scholarship. Congratulations, Alex. 
And finally, Carly Monroe has received a full academic chancellor scholarship through the Marcille J. Lee Scholars Program from the University of Wisconsin-Madison. In addition, she has also received the Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated Kappa Psi Omega Chapter Scholarship. Congratulations, Carly. And one more final congratulations to the entire class of 2020. We are so proud of you. Thank you.